Well, don't pass go. Do not collect $200. Go directly to the ICBC Claims Center. Somebody with a deep knowledge of the insurance game has put out a parody version of a popular board game. And as CTV Sinjin Alexander reports, the insurance corporation is not laughing. Whistler, $390. I'll buy it. Someone with a sense of humor, love for a classic, and knowledge of a big BC corporation has created a bona fide board game satire. Oh, I mean, they're, they're clearly somebody who has a lot to say about uh, yeah, ICBC and insurance. The cheeky ICBC monopoly was sent Monday night in plain packaging to McLean Kay, editor-in-chief of the Orca. A big box with no return address. And uh, when I opened it, there was an ICBC Monopoly board game. The anonymous creator spared little expense. No dogs, thimbles, or race cars here. Players can be dumpster fires, ICBC employees, or MLAs. It was really professionally done. Uh, it looks like a board game you'd buy in the store. Chance and community chests are mystery letters and renewal notices. You can't renew online. Pay $50. Add a new driver to your policy. Pay 100. Properties are the cities of British Columbia. The railroads, broker offices. And yes, there is free parking near ICBC headquarters. Jail is the ICBC Claims Center. This was clearly made by someone who wants to poke fun at ICBC. And McLean figures others will receive the game too. You don't make a dumpster fire piece for a Monopoly set and, and not at least trying to have fun with it. Perhaps no surprise, ICBC doesn't think it's such a hoot. Rather than playing games, we're focused on safely restoring services for British Columbians and implementing our new enhanced care model, which will lower auto insurance by an average of approximately 20%. By the way, the most coveted spot on the board isn't Boardwalk, but instead one of the most expensive cities in the world, Vancouver. The object of the game is the last to be insolvent. St. John Alexander, CTV News, Vancouver.